Aloha. You're watching F5 On Demand. I'm Peter Silva, Technical Marketing Manager with F5. We're here at Mandalay Bay Convention Center in Las Vegas for Interop 2012, booth 2137. If you're in town, please come on by, play our claw game, which is right over there. Hey, nice pan, Laura. So I have Danny Lutke with me. He's the Product Marketing Manager for our Big IP Local Traffic Manager product. Hi, Danny, thanks for joining us. How you doing, Peter? First time on the show, eh? It is. All right, Excited. welcome. So back at RSA, we announced the Big IP Data Center Firewall Solution, the ICSA Certified Network Firewall, and now it's been out in the market for a number of months, and I thought it'd be interesting to catch up with you to find out you know, how it's been deployed and how the customers are liking it. Absolutely, there's been a couple of different use cases that people have been very excited about um, using the Big IP LTM as a data center firewall. Um, the first use case is around DDoS protection. So we're finding that a lot of our customers are needing on-premise DDoS protection as part of their attack prevention strategy. Um, the DDoS prevention within the big IP LTM uh, provides a couple of different layers. One is the network layer DDoS attacks, and the second is the application layer DDoS attacks. And so why is that critical? I mean, protecting from layer three through layer seven, certain devices can only protect one, other devices can protect the other. So what's the importance of being able to do that? Well, being able to consolidate it all gives you one central place to look at everything from a single pane of glass of uh, providing protection against DDoS. Um, additionally, that we're finding that there's multiple layers of attacks that are happening when people are, are trying to exploit your, your sites. And so uh, when attackers are coming at you, they're not just using one type of DDoS attack, they're using multiple types of DDoS attacks, and so um, it's important to be able to get a wide variety of protection. Yeah, since the attacks are multi-layered, the protection needs to be multi-layered. Absolutely. And so one of the things that was just released, I think you were saying this week, is that right? Yes. Is the uh, Splunk reporting for the Big IP Data Center Firewall. Now, we have you know, Splunk reports for LTM, for ASM, for APM, for Edge Gateway, for Firepass, so can we take a look about uh, uh, what the Spunk reporting does for now the data center firewall? Yeah. So um, Peter, this is this is our um, this is our um, Splunk integration at the the Interop um, NOC. So it's the largest temporary network um, built around, um, and we have the the data center firewall doing a number of different services here. Um, one is IPv4 um, to IPv6, but in this case, what we've done is we have the the Splunk integration with the data center firewall. So you can take a look at the reporting. And you can take a look. This is a natively, um, this is um, designed by Splunk and supported by Splunk um, for this integration. You can see here, we can take a look at the traffic of a single device over time. We can take a look at the allows versus denies, the action breakdowns, um, what's being allowed by source, what's being blocked by, by source. Um, furthermore, we have um, denied by destination, a series of different reports that we can provide, um, what you typically see for a um, firewall administrator. And this is all I was noticing as you were talking, this is all being uh, updated in real time. So I saw like that um, allow and deny pie graph slightly you know, change a bit while you were talking, right? Absolutely, when you're, when you're dealing with, um, with firewall reports, you need everything to be in real time. So um, Splunk gives us that capability to scale at, a, at, at you know, F5 um, big IP um, scale and um, allows you to have real time updates in a in nice graphical format. That's pretty cool stuff. So um, I believe people can get this application off Splunk Base, right yes. off Splunk's website, right? Absolutely, just go to Splunk Base and, and you can download it there. Nice, so thanks for joining us, Danny. Interesting stuff, I love, I always love the Splunk stuff. And of course, they can, administrators can drill deeper into each of those graphs and pieces of information to get a little bit more, right? Absolutely. So there you have it, a little bit more follow up on our Big IP data center firewall and, and new here is the Splunk reporting for the Big IP data center firewall. So reporting from Vegas, for Danny, this time I got Lori behind the lens. I'm Peter and we're with F5 Networks. Thanks for watching.